Hi everybody, Jane here. Today I'm going to show you a quick idea on how to use this new stamp set of mine. It's called um, Tulip Set and the code is JGS714. I'm using three colours of pixie powder, Mango Blaze, Teal Wash and Burnt Orange. And I've got them in a palette here and I'm going to add a little bit of water to each colour. I've separated the colours so that they don't get mixed up whilst you're doing the um, washing on your watercolour card. So I've got my piece of watercolour card ready. I'm using a really thick brush to do this and I'm going to start with the yellow which is the lightest colour. I'm going to put that in the middle. So I'm going to brush up from the bottom um, some nice strong sweeping movements like that. I can leave a little bit of space at the, the bottom, a little space at the top. Clean your brush well, take some of the excess water off, then we'll go for the orange. This is um, the burnt orange. Put that next to the yellow. It doesn't matter if it touches at all. And then we'll go for the teal wash on the other side. There we go, nice and simple. Now to do the next step, which is stamping, you've really got to let that dry. So thankfully, I already had one dry. So here we are, it's all nice and dry, as you can see. And as it dries, the mica that's in the pixie powders cups the surface and makes it nice and shiny. And now we're going to uh, stamp the flowers. And you can use any kind of ink for this. I'm actually going to use a VersaFine uh, for now, but you could use a Distress Oxide would work really well if you had the uh, the colour that you like. And I've got the three flowers that are on the set and I'm going to stamp the three flowers on the top of my piece. So there's the first one in position. And then we'll take the other flower and we'll stamp that on the orange strip. And then we'll take the little one and we'll stamp that there on the other side. I've got my three flowers in position. I'm going to hand draw the stems with a black pen and we are going to um, draw from the flower down to the bottom, from the flower down to the bottom, from the flower down to the bottom. Okay, like that. And on the set of stamps you have got lots and lots of different leaves and we're going to stamp the leaves with the same colour ink pad and we are going to put those against the stems and uh, stamp whichever ones you want, however you want. Arranging them nicely. There's um, one, two, three, four, there are five of them. So you've got quite a choice to use. And some little ones, some big ones, they go in different directions and they can be stamped um, either way. Add a few more of these little ones to fill in some of the spaces. And uh, you can just finish when you're, I think you've done enough. So there's my leaves in position. And the greeting. That's going to go at the bottom. I'm going to stamp that in black. And that will just go right at the bottom, in the middle, over some of the colour a little tiny bit. There we go. And there's the finished stamped, stamped image. And then I've layered it onto um, contrasting card to um, before putting it onto, the, onto your card. And there's the finished card. So you can see I've also put some 3D accents on the top of the flower so that it um, marries up with all the other colours. So I've just used three colours on there. And then you can see the greeting at the bottom. And there we go. So thank you very much for watching.